Back to basics. Back to basics. Time to go back to basics. I got my small motor back. Okay. This is my small motor. My old small coil um, that you saw in the Dancing Newman motor video. I finally put this, the, the shaft, the correct shaft on the small motor. Now it's spinning really fast. Now let's check the voltage, okay? We're gonna pull this out because it's not supposed to be in the 20 amp port. Right now it's in 20 amp DC. We're gonna turn this off. Move it to the 1000 volt setting. And then we're gonna put it, okay. Now what's the voltage? Press. This is four volts. Earlier, okay, I had a bunch of voltage, okay. Uh, over 50 something volts, up to 59 volts, including the, this pack over here. But I'm not going to be using 59 volts this time. I'm going to be using 4 volts. 4 volts, back to basics. You might go back to high voltage later, but it's time to go back to basics. And, okay, let's just make sure this wasn't a joke. Bring it back. 4 volts. And just to see the decimal. Okay, do this again. Actually, this is 4.9. So this lacks, uh, is, this rounds down for some, it says 4.9. Go back. Now it says 4. Okay? So it's, it's actually, since it's 4.9, it's actually about 5 volts. Alright? So, back to 20 amp DC. And we're going to put this here. Now we're going to press. Okay. Good. Okay. Make sure I got this right. Needs a little bit help. And this is the the amps. Actually, the point something amps. Okay. All right. Now I'm using right now point twenty or point seventeen amps and four volts. So, let's say we had 0.2 amps, and we had 4 volts, that's 0.8 watts. Now, earlier we were spinning this big magnet, it has far more torque, and it was able to push a fan. I'm not able to do this with the small motor yet. Uh, right now I just have it free running. But, as you can see, it spins at much higher RPM on only four volts. Hmm, well, as fast as it is, this has no way of turning a fan. Like this, this big one can turn the fan for just, the, for the same power this thing spins. At four volts, like I showed you earlier, and between 0.15 and 0.20 amps. Okay, so what's that? It's between 0.6 and 0.9 watts. Almost like this motor, except this has a huge fan. This has no capability of turning that fan because it simply doesn't have the torque. Watch as I do this. Simple. This is, the moment I press here, And I'm it's not even that much. The moment I press put a load on it, the RPM drops very much. So as we can see, this is worse. It's fast, but it's worse than this. Okay? This, like I sh showed you on the previous video, so I don't have time to hook it up. But this is faster, but there's hardly any force to it. It stops. It goes really fast, but it has no, ha, hardly has any force. It vibrates a lot, but it, that's just the illusion that it's stronger, but it's actually weak. So there you have it.